Raven. Thank you for accepting this commission, and welcome to Kuamar. For the past 20 years, it has been controlled by two people, President Omar al-Bakr and his wife, Bibi Rashida. Their regime is both cruel and brutal, but we saw no reason to interfere. Till now. We have actionable intel Kuamar is planning an offensive against a neighboring state. A war here is unacceptable. It will disrupt the whole region, inflating global oil prices. The conflict was triggered by the assassination of President al-Bakr. His wife has taken power, but her grip is weak. Some within her government resent both her gender and Western education. However, she's supported by a close network of warlords. They provide troops and weaponry to Rashida, reinforcing her control and preventing open revolt. The regime is financed by the hacker and crypto anarchist, Lars Hellström. Wanted by multiple agencies, he threatens governments, rigs elections, and holds corporations to ransom. Together, they are the masterminds behind this offensive. We need you to shut them all down. We also have a friendly in country, Taj Tahir, a journalist and the son of one of Rashida's few political opponents. He disappeared after being arrested on espionage charges. Find him. Kumar's terrain is both arid and mountainous, so getting close to a target may not be possible. We know you're a long shot specialist, so this shouldn't be a problem. Your new gear should help, especially the prototype visor. It has an enhanced battlefield display and a direct comms link to me. Rashida and her allies cannot be allowed to ignite the region. Her war must be stopped. I'll be in touch. How's the heat there, Raven? It's time to get familiar with your weapons and gear. The tactical visor we supplied provides a live feed from your scope. It's equipped with an advanced combat display. You'll be able to scan terrain as well as tag and track hostiles. We've also given you some extra tools. We'd prefer it if you didn't break them. I'll run through their features on our live fire range. Once you're happy, we can move on to the mission itself. the mask's display to your biometrics. There's a training rifle ahead by the OP. Pick it up and let's begin. Roger that, Control. Take a prone position to stabilize your... Switch on your binocular display to enable hostile tags. Tag the target straight ahead. You're 12 o'clock. Tagging hostiles will give you their range and keep track of their movements. Your scope also allows you to measure range to targets. Go to glass and see for yourself. The upper left quadrant in your scope is a rangefinder. The target's height on that scale indicates their distance from you. It'll change according to your zoom ratio. Hit. Go for the next one. target, you're 12, 300 meters. I know you're used to doing the maths for range, wind speed and direction in your head, but we've saved you some time. Adjust for range and use the bullet drop curve to line the shot up. Miss. Remember, align the wind curve with the dis- Good. Raven, find your next target. Adjusting your scope to target's range will improve accuracy. I've marked the distance for you. Set your scope elevation to 400. By calibrating your scope properly, you won't have to manually adjust your aim up or down to compensate for the distance and bullet drop. Good. Splash four more now. There's plenty of ammo. Restock or reload when you need it. I know you're a marksman, but use your binoculars to tag hostiles before taking the shot. It'll give you distance to target to zero your scope.
Excellent. First target down. to go. Scope is zero now. We can move on to the next stage of familiarization. Head to the door behind you. Move through the door to the next area. We have some additional kit to familiarize yourself with. First up, Falcon Drone. Pick it up. Select it from your inventory. Now launch it. later. There's a CCTV access point in the building below. Send the drone in and hack it. to the CCTV box. Hacking one access point gives you control of all the cameras. 
cameras connected to it. It also prevents them detecting your presence. Any hostiles you spot on cam, you're up to speed on the drone now. There's another piece of kit on the table. Have a look. These auto turrets sync with your hood. You still need to mark hostiles for the turret manually, but it can then fire at your command. Once placed, you set it up via your mask's binocular mode. Focus on the hostiles you tag with the drone. Then you need to mark them for your turret. Remember, turret marking is separate from your binocular tagging. Once marked, you can execute the fire command. The turrets won't function till you mark targets with your binoculars. You're done with gear familiarization. One thing I should mention, you can use a turret's inbuilt camera for overwatch, or use it to execute simultaneous shots, if needs be. Also, the turrets are under constant development. You may be able to upgrade them later. That's all the new gear covered. We have a spot set up to test special ammo too. Or you can head straight out. There's a truck waiting in the back. Raven, I'm sure you know, the record for the longest sniper kill belongs to a Canadian Special Forces operator. During the Iraq War, he hit a target over two miles away. Today's mission won't need you to hit anything that far, but it's still going to be a challenge. This operation is designated Cold Bore Zero. We're dropping you onto a plateau located within range of all three targets. Your window of opportunity is small, so hit and move. The first target here is Antoine Zaza, Rashda's favorite warlord and quartermaster. The Zaza clan are arms dealers alongside other criminal enterprises. Eliminate him and the Kuamari government will struggle to equip their militias. Your second target is a disgraced SAS officer, Captain Ronald Payne. He's in charge of the Army's tactical training and currently stationed at one of their boot camps. Your third target is Colonel Fyodor Novikov, a Russian GRU agent sent here to control logistics and supply. Removing these actors from the board will seriously hamper Rashida's plans. Stay sharp. I'll be in contact when you arrive on site. Control, do you read? This is Raven. Roger, Raven. What's your status? I've exited the helo, and I'm commencing recon of the plateau. Intel indicates light foot patrols and some forward observation posts only. Proceed with caution and you should reach the sniper hides with little opposition. Understood. The plateau will provide you with three OPs which overlook each target location. They should give you a good line of sight on any hostiles. Sounds like a piece of cake. Except for the range, and with no spotter. I'm confident you won't miss. It's one of the reasons we picked you. No pressure then. Let me know when you've reached the first OP. Roger that. Raven out. I'm telling you, other guys are finding valuables all over the place. And there's everything. Trinkets, coins, artifacts. I know. The captain finds out. Don't worry about it. You go look in that cart over there. I'll search these. I have a good feeling about it.
Intel on Zaza. He may be conducting a deal today. Our sources tracked a known weapons supplier crossing the border earlier and heading up the main road to that location. If we're lucky, you'll catch them both. Do you have anything on the supplier's ETA? Negative. But one of the locals may have more info. For a hostile station near one of the comms relays. I'm sure they've heard the chatter. I probably won't be asking him nicely. How you do it is up to you. I found intel on a laptop. The weapons deal is imminent. Then you'd better get set up at the OP.
Control, it's Raven. I'm in position above the port. Copy that. Plan your shots carefully. Zaza's likely to run if you miss. So no alarms? Well, not before Zaza is dead at least. Control. I have eyes on the primary target. Confirmed. That's Antoine Zaza. At this distance, it's not going to be easy, even with all this fancy new gear. Agreed. But the basics don't change. Get him stationary to improve your odds. I'll line him up somehow. Good luck. Send when ready. Raven, we're tracking a vehicle on approach. Right side. Thanks for the heads up. Same mate. Target splashed. Zarza's down. Impressive. Not the record, though. Not this time. Besides, this off is off the books. Nothing here you can claim. Might want to also take care of the dealer since he's already arrived. It will earn you a bonus. Zarza is down, so I'm not going to be able to locate the dealer. His car stopped by a big warehouse. Right side. Look for hangar number two. Job done. On the move. Good work, Raven.
Sechs? Seven? I didn't expect the diet to be based on burgers. But, uh, the meat is great. I had no idea that Guam had breeds cattle of this quality. What is it important? Known. 
could use a drink right about now. That's odd.
Control its Raven. I'm approaching the old ship for pain's training. Roger, Raven. Do this quietly. If you alert them, you're going to be knee deep in hostiles. Pain has sniper training too, so expect the worst. Yep. It's always tricky without a flanker guarding my back. Do it smoothly, and you won't need one. Kill the fucker!
does that. There's no one here. Kill the fucker! 